Okay, in this video, we're just going to be dealing with some trig functions here. They're going to be given some information and then asked to find something else. So in this scenario, we're going to be given that the tangent of theta is 1 fourth and that my theta is in the first quadrant. Okay, so we want to find secant theta. Now, there's a variety of ways we could do this. You could use Pythagorean identities, all right, but you could also just use some right triangle trig, okay? Um, if I use a right triangle trig, I know theta is in the first quadrant, so if I draw a little reference triangle here with my triangle in my first quadrant, that would be a portion of that bow tie triangle that is pretty uh, common in a trig class. All right, my theta is going to be right here. I can label the sides of this triangle. So I would come up here, look at tangent. I know tangent is opposite over adjacent. So that's going to tell me a couple sides here. My opposite side then is going to be a 1. My adjacent side here is going to be a 4. Okay, then you could do um, just good old-fashioned a squared plus b squared equals c squared to find that hypotenuse. Okay, so a little Pythagorean theorem because I got a right triangle here. So 1 squared plus 4 squared equals c squared. 1 plus 16 equals c squared. So 17 equals c squared. That means my hypotenuse is going to be the square root of 17. Okay, so then we can plug that in there. Now I know all sides of my right triangle. I need to find secant. All right, well, secant theta is going to be hypotenuse over adjacent if you've got your right triangle trig definitions memorized. So then I can just look, okay, so my hypotenuse is square root of 17, and my adjacent side then is 4. So then secant theta is going to be square root of 17 over 4. All right, so pretty much just a straight... Um, forward question there dealing with your trig functions and like I said I chose to do the bow tie triangle and use a little bit of right triangle trig you could have also used the Pythagorean identities as well and solved it that way definitely thanks for watching if the videos are helping be sure and share with your friends so they can benefit too and don't forget to subscribe to the channel